so hi friends this is shanmuk so in this video i'll show you how to give access to any login on a specific table okay just is looking for permissions on a single table or or one or two tables okay but is looking for a permissions on a specific table not all the tables in the database okay in, in that case how to give permissions on a single table okay so for that first make sure again the login is existed in your login list if the login is not existed create the login using our old videos or if you know you can create the login okay whether it is a sql login or windows login the process is same so first of all i want to give access to this shanmuk login in the particular azdb1 database there is a table called employee on this employee table only employee table on this employee table i want to give access to shanmuk okay so for that what i have to do first go to the uh, shanmuk properties double click on the shanmuk login okay so here go to user mapping okay uh, and select the database which database the table is present select the database and simply give dbo schema here and don't select any of the roles if you select data reader data writer role it will give the access if, it, if you select data reader it, it, it gives the access on all the tables inside azdb1 which is not correct we are looking for a specific table permissions right just simply select the database don't select any roles database roles just click ok then the user will be created in the azdb1 database okay you can see here in the azdb1 if you go to security here you can see shanmuk user this is user guys this is not login this is user okay you see here this is a shanmuk login under logins list and this is a shanmuk user under database users list double click on shanmuk user okay you can give access to a table in two ways one is by going to the user properties or by going to the table properties first let's go with the user properties and a search here select all objects click ok there you can see tables you want to give access on tables right select tables <clears throat> now you can see which table you want to give access <clears throat> as i have only one table you can see only one table in this um, list we have multiple tables we can see multiple tables in this list on which table you want to give access select that particular table and what access you want to give whether you are looking for insert or select whatever permissions you want to give select means read permissions insert means write permissions update means update permission so like this whatever permissions you want to give give that particular permission okay and click okay so this is one way of giving permission okay on a specific table there is another way also so you can go with the table properties okay go to uh, table properties right click table properties now you have to search for the users okay so go to permissions and here okay search shanmuk is already there that's why you can see shanmuk here if it's not there you don't see shanmuk okay search and uh, which for which login you want to give access um this is for which user okay imagine again shanmuk is already existed right type shanmuk only check names if login is there you can see like this it will come under brackets and click okay what permissions it's already there that's why it is showing like this it was highlighted what permissions you want to give either you want to give insert permissions or select is already given in okay uh, in the last uh, section particular permissions on a table so select is already given that's why select permission you can see here i want to give insert so now you can give insert and you can click okay so like this we can give permissions on a specific table either by going to user properties or by going to the Table properties. Okay. Thank you for watching the video.